back at Hewish Park this time permanently. How pleased to, to sign? Yeah, I'm delighted. I mean, when uh, Yeovil yeah, contacted Bournemouth and uh, my agent and said about it happening, I was more than keen to uh, take the opportunity and, and see what's going to happen. Obviously, you played 10 games here last season. How different is it now? Is it still much the same? Uh, it's pretty much the same. I mean, there's a few new faces and good additions to the squad by the looks of things. And obviously, they're off to a much better start than uh, they was last year. And I'm hoping that that will continue. Obviously, still half of the season to go at the moment. What are you hoping to, to achieve in the, the second half of the season? Um, I think the feeling in the group is we want to push up the table and obviously get back to where we were a few weeks ago, I think, it's in the playoffs. So that's obviously the main aim. We want to be looking up rather than down. Obviously, it's still the same 4-3-3 formation that you played in. It's a, a system that you know well. I suppose you can, you can hit the ground running from that point of view. Yeah, hopefully. I mean, the gaffer obviously drummed it into us last year, the way he wants to play, and it's pretty much stood the same. Uh, seeing this pre-match meeting today, um, yeah, hopefully I can hit the ground running and, and see where it takes me. Obviously, Wickham tomorrow, you'll be involved in that match. What kind of game do you expect? Uh, Wickham are a great side, and obviously they're, they're quite high up in the table as it stands on a good run, but obviously we want to put an end to that and uh, focus on ourselves pushing up that table. Obviously, last time you were here, you were, you were standing here as a lone player. Does it feel different to be a, a Yeovil Town player now? Uh, to be fair, not really, just because the lads last year were so welcoming as they are this year. Just You're part of a, a great squad and um, a great bit of chemistry that the lads have got here, so uh, I can't wait to get started. We'll see, there's Bournemouth links already, Ben Whitfield and, and Matt Butcher. Did you have a chat with them about how the, the side's going this season? Yeah, they're saying it's great down here. They said that the, the chemistry, like I said, is really good and, and they're playing well, they're battering teams and, and doing really well, but just not getting the every result that they want. Um, they said the feel the feel down there is really good, so obviously that was a, a key factor to me coming. We obviously, you can see what you can do at, at Dagenham last season, the goal that you scored. I, I imagine you'll be hoping to do the same in the games that you've got coming up now. Yeah, for sure. I mean, it was only the, the one goal last year, so I'll be hoping to, to get a few more than that in the uh, closing stages this season, which I, I can't wait to add to. Do you set targets? Uh, not particularly, no. I mean, I just take each game as it comes and try to perform the best of my ability. But yeah, I mean, I want to score goals and I want to put the team at the table. So.